guess I'll just look at your YouTube subscriber count and divide by 100. Oh no, that sounds like a math problem. <laughs> what a horrible life, right? If you happen to see math in the real world. Yeah, that's the only time you guys can really do math, dealing with positive and negative numbers. Oh, uh, I gained five followers, but I lost eight. That's a net result of negative three. Oh, you can do negatives, great. Here it is in a test. I can't do negatives. Uh, what at log of one million? Log 10, so how many zeros are there? Six. Yeah, you're right. It's log base 10. You count the zeros. There are six. You, that's right. Take a stretch. Oh, that's a big one. Oh, big problem. Uh, you're going to see something like that in your test. Three points. Three bleeping points. Just do it. How about log of one over one thousand? One, two, we got three zeros. It's easy to throw in the one there because you think four digits, but you count the zeros, there's three. Or no, there are three, and it says negative. Okay. Um, what about log base 109 of 1? All right, just make sure we understand that's going to be 0. If I do log, what was that? Okay. It's, I sure hope so. What's log base 13 of 13? 1. See, there we go. Somebody have a, a bucket of water? He's on fire. <laughs> got to put him out. How about natural log of E to the seventh? What does natural log mean? It's that constant, whatever his name is. <coughs> well, natural log means log base E, right? Yeah. Of e this one. guy E to the seventh. So what's your answer? Seven. Seven. Right? You could even go to your calculator, because I know you love your calculator. You love it so much, why don't you marry it? If I do natural log of e, so second natural log e to the seventh, look what I get. I get seven, right? That's right. Mine equals blown. Make sure you clear up your mess before you leave. Oh, that's not nice. So what do you think the answer would be to this? Natural log of e to the 7,145. It should be the same kind of thing as this, right? So what's the answer? And this is where I just laugh at you guys for not paying attention to anything that I tell you. Because if you come over here to the calculator, like I know you guys love to do, and you go natural log of e to the 7,145. Let's see what, the, see what your calculator says. The number's too big for it to handle. Because it's going to try to evaluate this power first before applying the natural log. That's too much. But you know what? We didn't need a calculator because we were that good. What if I ask you to do log of 373? Log base 10 to the 373? Yeah. Um, Is this a power of 10? No. So what are you going to have to do? Yeah, you got, this is where you actually have to use the calculator. And all you have to do is type log of 373. That's it. You're going to see questions like this in your homework, so be happy that you have nice, easy questions. Round to the nearest thousandth, what do we have? 2.572. Are we going to have to write that approximation symbol in our test when we're estimating? Nah, I'll let you get away with that. All right. Um, and finally, if I say what's log base 23 of 798. Well, here's the thing. 23 to the first is 23. 23 squared is 529. 23 to the third is going to be bigger than that. Right, so we can do log of 798 over the log of 23. You do the change of base. It should be between 2 and 3. It should be between 2 and 3. Now let's see if that's true to finish this up for today. So if I do log of 798 divided by 
log of 23. So, 2.13. Wait, I got something different. Because you didn't do the input parentheses at the end of the 7. Oh, I was supposed to close that off? Yeah. So if I don't, I can get a bad answer? Oh! I guess I should have listened to myself when I said that earlier, right? I did. That's I did. And see, now I'm pressing the buttons more vigorously. Is that what you guys have now? Yes. So this is approximately 2.131. Check yourself really quick on this. If I take 23 raised to the 2.131, it's not exactly 798 it's going to be close enough to let me know I'm on the right track. Okay. 